Assalamu alaikum. This is Jahangir and you are watching Medical and Nursing Lectures. Dear learners, our today's topic is common terminologies used in the field of medical surgical nursing. So the first terminology is acidosis. Acidosis means increase of acid level in the body. Acute means the sudden and severe attack of disease in short period of time. Alkalosis means increasing of alkali level in the blood or increase in your pH level. Amenorrhea means absence of menses. Anorexia means loss of appetite of food. Antipyretics means all those drugs which reduce your fever. Antibody means immunity of blood protein against infections. Antigen means virus, bacteria, protozoa or fungus which cause disease in your body. Apnea means absence of breathing for a few seconds. The seconds is ranges from 10 seconds. If, if you hold your breath more than, for more than 10 seconds, so that is called apnea. Uh, if a patient having uh, if a patient have developed the episode of uh, stoppage of breathing for more than 10 seconds so that is called apnea arthritis means inflammation of joints asymptomatic means absence of symptoms biopsy means examination of the tissue which obtained from body bladder irrigation means washing of urinary bladder usually we do this with the normal saline Bradycardia means low pulse rate below than 60 beats per minute. The normal range for the uh, heart rate is from 60 to 100. Bronchoscopy means direct physical examination of trachea and bronchus tubes by the help of bronchoscope instruments. Colostomy means the opening or removal of colon. Colostrum means first fluid or immunity secreted by breast milk after delivery up to few days, five days of lactation. Coma means unconscious condition with no response of eye movement and painful stimuli. Congenital means at birth or since birth. CT scanning means computerized tomography. Cyanosis means lack of oxygen with the signs of bluish of nose tip, ear lobe, and nail tips. Cystoscopy means the direct physical examination of urinary bladder by the help of cystoscopy instruments. Dehydration means lack of fluid and electrolytes in the body. Diagnosis means the decision for exact disease. Disease means it is a condition which disturbs the natural function of body and it has specific signs and symptoms. Drug means it is a chemical substance for the diagnosis and treatment of disease. Drug therapy means treatment by drugs without operation or by using medicine just. This means painful or difficulty. So dysmenorrhea means passing of painful menses. Dyspnea, difficulty with pain and breathing. ECG means electrocardiography which we use for the heart problems or heart diseases and EEG means electroencephalography which we use in the disease of brain emetic means vomiting endo means inner or internal endoscopy means direct physical examination of esophagus stomach and duodenum by the help of endoscope instrument 
Gastrectomy means the opening or removing of stomach complete or partial. Gastritis means inflammation of stomach. Glossitis means inflammation of tongue. Glucotherapy means treatment by glucose. Hemoptysis means blood passing and sputum. Hematuria means blood passing and urine. Headache means pain in head. Hemiplegia means paralysis of one side of the body, which may be left or right side. Hepatitis means inflammation of liver. Hepatomegaly means enlargement of liver. Hepatosplenomegaly means enlargement of liver or and spleen as well. Hypercalcemia means increasing of calcium level and blood or body. Hypercalciuria means passing of calcium and urea. Hyperglycemia means increasing of sugar level in blood. So the fasting blood sugar which is called FBS uh, should be uh, from 70 mg per dl to 110 mg per dl and your random blood sugar should be from 140 mg per dl to 180 or 200 mg per dl hyperthermia means increase in temperature level from the normal body temperature Hypothermia means decreasing temperature level from the normal body temperature. Immunity means resistance power of the body against the infection. Incision means opening or cutting. Inflammation means swelling, pain and other three cardinal. IVP means intravenous phylography x-ray. Leprotomy means opening of the abdomen. Leproscopy means direct examination of abdominal cavity by the help of endoscope instrument through passing the abdominal muscles. Malaise means feeling of illness. Mastectomy means removal of breast. Mastitis means inflammation of breasts. Medical means it is the branch of science for diagnosis and treatment of the diseases by the drugs without operation. Metastasis means spreading of cancer and blood. Maturation means frequent and painful urine passing. Monoplegia means paralysis of one limb. Myo means muscles. Nausea means about to vomit. NSAIDs means non steroidal anti inflammatory drugs such as aspirin, ibuprofen, diclofenic. Odema means accumulation of fluid in body. Oncology means scientific study of cancer or tumor. Ophritis means inflammation of fallopian tube. Perisynthesis means removal of fluid from the peritoneum cavity. Paraplegia means paralysis of both legs. Peri means the outer part. Pertussis means whooping cuff. Photophobia means fear from light. Protectomy means removal of rectum tube as partial or complete. Proctoscopy means direct examination of rectum tube by the help of proctoscope instrument in case of piles. Pupil dilated means widening of eye pupil. Quadriplegia means paralysis of four limbs. Radiotherapy means treatment by radio x rays or x rays. Rehabilitation means to restore the body functions. Retention means blockage. 
Rigorous means shivering with cold, hot and sweating stages. Shock means cold condition of patient with decreasing vital signs and fluid in the body. Sigmoidoscopy is direct examination of sigmoid colon and rectum tube by the help of sigmoidoscope instrument. Surgical means it is the branch of medical science for diagnosis and treatment of the disease with drugs and operation. Surgical therapy means treatment by operation or surgical procedure. Symptomatic therapy means treat the signs and symptoms of the disease. Syndrome means collection of disease. Tachycardia means rapid pulse rate above than 100 per minute. Tachypnea means rapid respiration per minute. The normal respiratory rate is from 12 breath per minute to 22 breath per minute. So if the rate is increased from uh, this normal range, so we will call that tachypnea. Thoracosynthesis means removal of fluid from pleural cavity. Thrombosis means blood clotting. Ultrasonography means radiological technique in which deep structure of the body is visualized by recording echo reflection of ultrasonic views directed into the tissues. Ultrasound means ultrasonic views used to examine the interior organs of the body. Vaginal douche means vaginal washes by fluids as with normal saline or with soap, etc. Wheezing breathing means breathing with sounds such as in asthma. Febrile means a patient having fever, while afebrile means a patient with no fever. Hyperpyrexia means fever above 1 to 5 Fahrenheit. Bradypnea means patient having decreased respiratory rate than normal. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and comment on the video.